Hello everyone, I'm ExtraCheesy87 and this is Let's Play Trails of Cold Steel 3 Part 91. In the previous video, we battled Bardius in the one-on-one -on -one fight with Reen. Uh, we did have to back out and redo the fight again to properly set Reen up so that he could actually survive a 1v1 duel. But then we did that, came to Raquel, talked to some people. We're gonna go in the bar, see if we can find Sarah. See if she can give us any deets on what's going on around here before we head out to fight our monster. And then we're going to go back to Ortis to talk with Yussi. Ah, nothing better than alcohol after working all night. That guy was worth every mirror. All right, I'm a drink and finally use a bed for sleep. Um, um, what was the bed used for otherwise? Oh God, oh, you're going to get us banned by the ESRB. How long will you be in town, Ash? Huh? Uh, probably a couple more days. <laughs> the day of your mother's passing is close. I wanted to surprise her. Some yummy ice cream in the sight of her boy all grown up ought to do it. Don't treat me like some offering for the dead. I feel like coming back I will. Write to me before you do, I'll have everything ready. Ash is pretty blessed. He doesn't look the least bit lonely. You should visit your mother's grave. You haven't gone in years. She deserves better. I'll think about it, so put a lid on it, would ya? Is that Maya? Who's that with her? You know. It's the man who picked up that gym yesterday. Hmm. Thinking in the morning again? You just don't learn, do you? No, this is... My, my smell like booze is just water, I sw swear. I think I'm dumb enough to believe that. Where'd you even get the mirror for this? I meant you just pawned off everything at home and... No, I picked up some odd jobs here and there. I mean, I lost most of a gambler, but I get some of it back sometimes. And I haven't pawned off any of your mother's things. Eh, you better not even think about it. Eh, can't even imagine how furious I'd be if you did. Just disowning you wouldn't be enough. But my, we shouldn't keep spying on her. Yes, let's get going. Yeah, we shouldn't keep spying on her. <laughs> spying time. You're kidding, right, my? You wouldn't disown me, would you? Like as I said, we should leave them be. Okay. The privacy respecter is logged on. What's up? Look at you up all bright and early. Look, you're ready to seize the day. Hey, Instructor Sarah. Thank you for yesterday. You arrived this morning, I take it. Yep, now I'm just sitting here waiting for a call from the guild. There's something that's been bothering me, but that's not important now. Just give me a shot if you need anything. That's what I'm here for. Thanks, we will. I think this must be bothered by the Northern Jaeger's involvement in all this. So waiting for the guild to contact me and slowly down to boredom. So if you need anything, let me know. Seriously, I'm begging you. Well, uh, our quest? Okay. They told me to talk to you, but I guess we didn't really have to. Well, in that case, I think we can start moving our way up north. Do we want to make any changes to the party? Um, accessories. This is all still fine. You don't necessarily need Prevent Petrify, per se. Yeah, give you the Dark Emblem back. I forgot we had another one of those. There's also an argument to give it to you, but... I don't know. We'll wait and see if we have to make changes depending on what we fight. Just up ahead is where the monster was spotted. They said it was just off the canyon to the north. It's an area of particularly rough terrain. We had never heard of any beasts setting up camp there. A giant monster, right? let's just kill the thing. We fought two cryptids and crossbows, so this could be another one. It was a lot more dangerous than what we fought yesterday. <laughs> that I'd like to see. Is this monster related to the Prolomagrass? No, Prolomagrass should only show up in Crossbell. I've never seen it here, even when the cryptids started appearing during the Civil War. Well, uh, all we know is that it's one hell of an enemy. I think we can handle it as a class. So we'll have to take care of it, but you'd rather... You'd rather that be the provincial army, that's perfectly fine. If you'd rather that be the provincial army. Think about what you want, decide as a team. <laughs> Let's see. Starting this quest will allow you to explore the Northern Canyon. Absolutely. In that case, sounds like you're about to tackle one big baddie. Oh, okay, so this is when you join. Director Sarah, what could decide to crash the party? Like I said before, I've had a time to kill while I wait for a call from the guild. Any problem with a tag along? You will? By all means. Are you kidding? We don't need a bracer. We just might. She's far more skilled than any of us. Yes, yeah, so with her, we might not have to do a thing. 
I can't seem to agree. I'm a chiming. Getting rid of monsters is all part of being a bracer. If I ever get in the way, I'll watch. Sound good? But really, this is something I want to check up on. Like what? Huh? It's your decision, but I would recommend letting her join. It never hurts to have insurance and you don't know what you're going up against. It's also a chance for you to see the skills of a top-ranking bracer. Her abilities are far beyond mine. I doubt. Platter will get you everywhere, my dear. I'd hesitate to say I'm far beyond you these days, though. Well, then let's just say I'm still early, early in my career. I'd vote to let her come with us. You okay with that, Ash? That's what floats your boat. I'm eager to see why you're called the Purple Lightning. It's because she uses Purple Lightning? For reasons? I don't know. I'm glad you'll be with us. Would you kindly tell us more about Instructor Reed and his boyhood years? I mean, they haven't known each other that long. I guess that's fine. It sure isn't. Alright, off to the canyon. We can let the monster eat music. The game will be better for it, I promise. Now the question is, who do we get rid of? I mean, it's either Kurt or Ash. Probably Ash. This side looks fairly run down. I expected it was often used at one point. No, no, but these days everyone just travels by train. You want to walk all the way to Jirai when, when you've got full wheels. So you can get all the way to the northwest from here? Jirai's a special economic zone like Crossbell, right? Right, it's a fraction of the size, but it's a bustling city. We need to investigate where the crypt was last seen. Oops, got sidetracked. I'll take the map out. I haven't gone that much way. The only time I can think of was when I jacked up some thieves with some friends once. Why were you doing that? I just knew you were a wild child. Let's see if you can jack up a crypto the same way if you lost all your moves. You'll see, I got more moves than you pros. Good job using trash talk to fire him up, instructor. We will now officially begin our investigation on the cryptid. Keep in mind though that we can always can always go back to town and regroup if we need to. Use me and Instructor Sarah wisely to achieve success. Yes, sir. Off we go. So, I mean... I mean, Kurt and Sarah basically do the same thing. In the sense that, you know, they hurt hard and attack relatively fast. Honestly, I think Kurt's better just because Blade Dance is super strong. And Thor is not that awe-inspiring of a Master Quartz. And her Quartz setup is bad. But I mean, I definitely want to use her. Um, so I guess we get rid of Ash. Also, we can change your... Oh yeah, I need to give you your stuff back. Kind of like you have in La Forte. But Ash... Well, Ash, we're getting rid of you, so yeah, we'll give you La Forte temporarily. And you don't need Fortuna anymore. I guess Seraphic Ring? That or a hit? I don't know. We just don't attack too often with you. I'll just kind of give you some like filler stuff for now. And we'll make changes later. We need to, depending on the fight and how hard it is. I think you keep Keeper. I think Keeper's quite good. Alright. I mean, just the 14 initial damage reduction alone is quite strong. What in the hell are you? We got him now. It's down! This one's mine! You've been it's my turn! You've been platypus? What? Yeah. Very well. Uh -huh. Hurt, My turn. Hurt Vander is uh -huh. here. My turn. You would like to play? Uh -huh. There. It's mine. Let's go. Sit. I'm up. Crimson Slash. 
Very well. There. Oh, we should have tried to set up a finish. <laughs> right on. With uh, Sarah or something. <laughs> good work. Oh, we got level three there. Art support. I mean, not good for Rain, but that's good in general. Oh my God, it's a big one. Are you considered a different species? Ha! Yeah. They're in disarray. You are. Well, we've encountered you. Um, see ya. Okay, this is risky for the Bisky, let's but let's go. go. Raging fire formation. Second form, Gale. Man, that did nothing. This one's mine. A little, little. Uh... Uh -uh. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Here I go. Um. You see, the thing is, uh, they have 50k HP. Are you insane? Can you be fainted at least? Okay, I assume Sigurd's thing still does faint damage. We will burn out our raging uh -huh. fire some, but... Let's go. Can you forte? Nope. Can you be fainted? Okay, you can. Does your craft still do 100% faint? It seals. It used to faint. Okay, the seal still works. You probably do more damage with a straight 100 or 200 CP ult. You could try and boost your strength. Do I really want to expend resources on a trash fight? Not really. Could use like a power potion. We don't really ever use those normally, because they're too weak. Hot. Time to get a little serious! Ah! I make you feel all tingly. So in hindsight, we probably shouldn't have hit the backline ones or the weak ones. Okay, they are sealed. Uh, you not survive? Not today. Thank you. Here I go. We can so iron will. Iron will right. formation. Can we get a? We can't get a breath. We can't get a tear in Tom. Could accelerate. Okay, you're still sealed. All right, I'm gonna risky for the bisky. Arcus, activate. Very well. Ah, uh, down. An AT delay. Don't know if it did enough, but <laughs> he went to sleep. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. A man just rested on us. I assume it's like a full heal. A full heal and a speed buff. Let's go. Ha 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 ha. motherfuckers really play Pokemon and they're like, yeah, rest stalling. That's that's the inspiration we should take. Uh -huh. My turn. Everyone loves rest stalling. It's so fun. Uh -huh. There! And yeah, we got one seal. It's mine! My blade, calm as still water. Can you seal the other one. And you broke one. Here I go. Some faint, faint could work. But you probably want a quick star that boy Kurt. He's got no CP though, so actually I think you want a quick star. That boy, Reen. Because, I mean, I just want to get rid of the delay. Here's what you could... You could Raging Fire. Let's go! Raging Fire formation! 
then quick start Kurt. Let's go. Then Kurt Let's raging go. fires. Let's go. Blade uh, dances. Very well. Wackity go. smackities. It's my turn. Bro, break. Let's go. Sir. My break, it's very broken. You nightmare. It was kind it's of turn. not actually that good, but. So we could hit and then light speed flash. Now! This one's mine! Yeah! Scatter your foe! It's light my speed turn! Flash. Fortunately, that doesn't hit everyone, but... Here's our tap. An opening! Here I go! She's got no CP. You can't escape! Our chance! Too slow! Very well. You do have to blade dance. You blade dance, then you get your four extra CP, then you can rain slash. You're dead. You just don't know it yet. It's down. You, however, are not dead. It's my turn. Just yet. You are close to dead, but you have not yet embraced the concept of death. Link with Kurt. It's my turn. I mean, you'll, you'll die to burn, but how do we want, we can try and set up a link, potentially. We could do like Yuna and Sarah pretty easily. Sit. You kill. Very well. It's my turn. So we want you to do, you won't kill, but you should do enough that Sarah's, because Sarah's strength is buff, so this should definitely be a follow-up finish. That was actually pretty fun. <laughs> Not too shabby. I was just trying to keep up. Having two sources or two S crafts that seal works pretty well there. Because Kurt, is yours yours is at a hundred percent? It's just fifty percent, right? But we got kind of lucky there, but it is like for, well, it's like five turns because of Bluster, right? So that helped a lot. Have we fought the mosquitoes? Or whatever you're supposed to be? We'll end this quick! And we've encountered you. I don't really want to, like, actually fight you, if I'm being honest. Very well. Let's fall back. You know Let's what? keep See moving. Ya. There. We, we I don't know if that counts for our combat log. I also I don't care about the combat log, but That last fight took long enough as is. Please don't don't, <laughs> fight, me. don't fight 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 me. They're in disarray. Let's fall back. Keep moving. Okay, cross crusade rare. I mean, that's something, I guess. Cowards. Don't let me go to dry. Oh, okay. Guess you don't really like crow that much after all, Reen. You don't want to go to dry. Okay, I see how it is. We don't have no CP, which is a slight issue. Did we get to keep Angelica's emblem? We did not. Lame. I mean, it's not even very good, but the CP could have been nice. And we have a decent amount on everyone, and we have 4 BP, so hopefully this won't be absolute hell. And if we have to back out and grind CP, we have to back out and grind CP. That's it! Yeah, it's exactly as described. Oh god. It's, it's Spicy Puppy, he's back. But even stronger, and lightning based now. A beast-like cryptid. It's aggressive as shit. Well, yes, but... 
Why is there scholar pomegranates here? I thought that plane was unique to Crossbell. Are there similar reports on the guilds in? Not exactly. I heard the Empire's magic knights being sighted in Crossbell. Tova and I only figured the opposite could happen too. You two are dead on. This is really interesting. I really just need to kill the cryptid and do some gardening like last time. Like last time? You weren't there. What are you talking about? <laughs> That's right. This looks like a new species though, so be on your guard. I'll leave how we approach this to you. Understood. I'm ready. Okay, so you... He's a lightning boy? Lightning is usually associated with seal. So we'll at least equip some anti-seal stuff. Okay, we have nothing. <laughs> we have regular coral rings, but we have anything better? Okay, this is better. Can we have two of those? We did. So it's only rain, does it? Okay, worst case scenario, if Reen does get, like, sealed forever, he can just be, like, a Chrono Drive Laforte. Er. And he has Spirit Unification, potentially, to nullify statuses, so. Ha! Fine. It's powerful. We must take care. He doesn't want to fight one of his Catboy brethren. This one's strong. Oh god, he's like right in my fucking grill, dude. -uh. Okay, good start. I'm up. Form up. Iron will formation. Poison. Weak to fire. Okay, we will probably want to use Muse. I mean, Muse should just rip ass here with zero cannon if we can get Fortunas off. Stat down, nightmare. Sleep. Speed first, then strike. I won't let you. Okay. Here I go. And you do get the holy breath off, and it's hitting oh, everyone. This is nothing. Pog. I'm a little scared to move you, so I think you're just gonna stand still. And uh, blade dance one time, uh, this is just to max out your speed, and then just do like this. It's down, an opening. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. You maybe should have just hollow sphered actually. Yeah. He's blinded. Yeah. Did we get lucky, or is he weak? He always really weak to blind. Okay. I don't think we have, like, a blind quartz or anything, but that could be good. Or is defense and speed. Okay, we resisted the speed down. Cool. Very... Very cool. Spirit unification! Let's go! The Rainster is logged online. Lowered speed and you froze. Very well. Actually, it's not that good because it let him get his uh, blind off for free. Uh Let's go. Uh Strike there. You nightmare. Which kind of isn't really that good per se because we're not. We were gonna crit regardless. Um. Really, that doesn't double hit? I mean, I'd rather you stay asleep. I got this. Here's our chance. It's mine. It's my turn.
Okay, so you do hit it at this range. I mean, the covers are pretty good. Let's go. I don't know how to use light speed flash best. We would want to use it in like a string where we're going to attack multiple times in a row, probably. Form up, iron will formation. Okay, that does mess with My our turn. formations. Uh, strike. Yeah. Hey yo, Kurt, what the fuck, man? Orcas activate! Yeah. Not today! Alright! Okay, so keep him alive. May as well breath for your own benefit. Uh, Rini Bobini is still a lava chini. Arcus, activate! Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Let's go. Mm, little spooky scary. I'm a little worried that like what's gonna happen here is we're going to interrupt and then he does the classic J Cam's gonna cast the ability again instantly. Form up, iron will My turn. Uh, there. Counter? Oh my god, the counters, they now. do exist. It's mine. It's my turn. Okay, so you're buffed now. You can try and do something, I guess. I'm up! You have lost your speed buff now. Arcus, activate! It's my turn! Okay. I want everyone to not be in a line. Yeah. You're lucky. Okay, you heal Rini Bobini. Thanks. I got this. And we just do like no damage. Uh, strike! Eight's down. An opening. It's my turn. AT delay. Uh, we'll pretend that did something. Uh, Ow! Oh, that go. faints. Well, shit. That's an issue. That's like a big problem. Oh no. Form up. Iron will my turn. That may have actually been worth divine songing. Okay, so that hurts, and it it's looks like it turn. does seal because we double resisted. We also could maybe use like some auto CP up, like the regular gladiator belt on Sarah, because she's just not generating enough CP. <laughs> My turn. Like we are just not doing any damage. Uh Let's go. Forma, iron will Let's go. formation. Uh Strike. Uh Let's go. Um, yeah, honestly, I kind of want to, it's hard to make, it's going to be really hard to make Muse work with this squad, but I think Muse is the best bet. I want to at least see his enrage. Spirit unification. Let's go. But I think our best bet's going to be trying to do caster stuff with Muse. Roll. It's down. Just because it's Zero mine. Cannon should be able to All hit right. for like 20k a pop with the double weakness if we can somehow manage to buff him or buff her. I would prefer keeping Kurt alive because 
Sarah might just straight up live, even if she gets hit. It's my turn. And so we're definitely gonna want some anti faint as well. Okay, this is actually a decent time to light speed flash, maybe. Scatter your foes! Light All speed right. flash! We just want to do as much break as possible. Take this! My turn! Uh, there! An opening! I'm up! Okay. Get with Kurt. Fatal Helix. Now what's probably gonna happen is even we're going to we're not gonna be able to kill him, but we can do some big boy damage it's here. My turn. You can't accelerate Sarah, sadly. Take this! Our chance! This one's mine! Very well. You do have to blade dance. Uh -huh. Very well. This does the most damage. It's down. An opening. Let's go. Your arts have been lowered. Bet you feel real stupid now, don't you? Let's go. Raising fire formation. Non arts have an ass. Get back. It's down. It's mine. I mean, he is still nightmared. Uh, oh, yeah, because he's not breaking out of his thing because he hasn't actually taken a turn. I kind of forget that's how break works. Oh, oh, no. Okay, so we have to sledgehammer. It's the only way to get the CP we need. Unless, do we think Yuna and Kurt can live? Not really. Nah. I mean, may. Well, we could Ebon Crest. You know what? I believe in the Altina. Let's go. Ebon Let's Crest. Go. You could try and like switch in like Muse and have her start casting her spell. It won't be buffed up, but I mean, it'll still do good damage. All right, I'm gonna. This is. Good we're luck. going fucking crazy. <laughs> Leave it to me. This doesn't use an Evan Crest, does it? Okay, it doesn't. Just making sure. Huh? He's only enhanced for three turns. Hollow Sphere Muse. Let's go. Very well. Long as you cast your ability afterwards. Hell, Hollow Sphere fucking I don't know yourself. Arcus, activate! Now, the issue is that he's probably gonna do this again right after for another 20k heal. Here I go. Arcus, activate! <laughs> Thanks. There. Goodbye, Sarah. It was nice knowing you. Unfortunately, this came in while he's still enhanced, so it's not gonna do. I mean, it did still did 5k. So it does about 10k base with no buffs. Wait, Sarah lived? Wow. <laughs> All right. I did not expect that. Uh, <laughs> I got this. There's no way you have enough movement to go hit that girl with an arts buff. You almost do. Altina, I think, has Fortuna. Trying to get Altina in here is a uh, fucking suicide. Let's go. I'm going. But Hollow Sphere. 
I mean, he's gonna... He didn't double in hand. Oh, you motherfucker. Very well. You are a little... Uh Very well. Fortunately, Hollow Sphere doesn't work that well with Kurt, because he has to blade dance. Uh, strike! It's my turn! One of those rare times where I'm wishing Mercurio was a spell I actually respected. Instant holy breath from downtown. Hey, you can just use regular breath. Marcus, activate. Ha! Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. I got this. Please, please tell me something here impedes. Oh no. Green has no CP. You do have CP though. Kurt also has CP. All right. Here's the fucking play. You get over here. This one's on the house. I'm going. It didn't do any damage. Also, that doesn't move you. I, I knew that. Do you have anything that cures mute and gives arts? I highly doubt it, but that would be pogged up right now. I can't believe this motherfucker mutes. I mean, it makes sense considering he's super weak to magic, but. Okay, since we don't have anything... Mind potions only cure stat down, right? Not statuses? Yeah. They'd be too good otherwise, I guess. Okay, take me just a... What is it? Insulating tape? Does make you lose your hollow sphere. Honestly... Not, mm. All right, there's a part of me that says just fucking hit her. You think I give a shit? You think I care if Sarah dies? Oh god, he's moving again instantly. Oh no! Don't give up. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Very well. Please Very and well. unbalance. I'm begging you. Thank you. Keep it up. All right. Form up. Iron Will formation. Okay, since you can't instance here, fuck it. Arcus activate. You motherfucker. <laughs> it's my turn. Arcus activate. Bro, would you stop? Not today. What is your issue? Yeah. Oh my god, you can't hollow sphere in time? Seriously? Sarah! Let's go! My turn. Please hit Kurt. Uh, strike! Fuck him up. Activating no master plan. Notice as you're still fucking muted. God, I hate you, Muse. Could we kill 30k? You are buffed up. Thirty K Ash would switch in. Okay, I think. Uh, it's, it's spicy. Alright. You got no BP. You'll do what, like 10k-ish? Ash would do like 10k?
That's like 20k. Then Kurt and Sarah, could they do another 10k? Sarah is not buffed. I think we would need the Raging Fire. Because like I can't just rely on the switch-ins for Maltina and Ash. Because he'll probably heal. Like, I assume he's going to enhance again. Even though he is already at really low HP. But they have enhanced at, like, super low HP in the past. So what we do is I think we commit... If I can fucking find him, Jesus Christ. You Brave Seed? <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Not yet. Your Raging Fire... Let's go! Raging Fire Formation! <laughs> Not yet! Your Brilliant Shot... I'll cast... That did 14. <laughs> Not yet! And it blinded, which doesn't really mean anything because he's probably about to enhance. So then... You do Sarah first. Time to get a little serious. I, we can't... I don't think we can stall enough to get Kurt to 200, but don't let your memes be dreams. <laughs> Not yet. You become Ash. You got this. I'm up. Okay, this man's dead. Now. Behold, the dual blades of Vander. That's a fun fight. Uh, I'll end it. Ha! Ragna, strike! I got, I got literally no complaints. Now his roar, both sealing or fainting and muting, is a little annoying, but. Like the fact that his super attack Behold didn't actually one shot us was a uh, pretty cool, nice change of pace there. Regulus is leveled up. What do you get? Dope. Oh, oh, that's that's really good. Bro, Regulus is fucking cracked. My dream of Reen just s crafting over and over again becomes even closer to reality. Level six. Guys, we're just like little minor stat boosts. All right. And I guess it's seven. Does it remove the delay after casting entirely? Like, it, is it like busted fire bells from uh, Azur? Yeah, I did it. I must train even more. Woohoo! <laughs> I grew a little. Stats updated. <laughs> nice. Good work. Purple Lightning. Damn it, she's a powerhouse too. She did like almost literally nothing in that fight. <laughs> she was just there to hollow for people that didn't really do anything. Is this what it means to be an A ring bracer? I'm gonna lost her words. I mean, really, that was the Kurt Vander show, as per usual. He was like the only one that was like consistently attacking him and Reen a little bit. So these are the spiritual plants that were blooming during the independence thing in Crossbell. Independence thing. Tell me you didn't play Azur, that tell me you didn't play Azur. It reminds me of the spirit veins in the Infernal Castle. Yeah, so those are things of the past, so why are these things still, still blooming? Best to get rid of them as we see it. Fine by me, I just want a few samples. Oh no, don't touch grass, it'll demonize you. Should we inspect the area? Yeah, there could be more. Go ahead. It'd be stupid not to look when it's this close to town. Let's split up. The group searched the area for more Paloma grass before confirming there was none. They then returned to Raquel with Sarah. Thank you so much for helping us. I feel like I learned a lot just from observing you. A little less graceful than I heard, but hey. I'm impressed how much experience you all have. Tell that instructor of yours to keep up the good work. We plan on it. I'd like for him to give us all kinds of new experiences. Shut up. Thanks for coming along, Instructor. You really helped us out. Mind if I left the Scarlet Promo Grass to you? Not at all. You've got your hands full, so I can take care of it. Good luck with your missions, okay? I'll be at Hermit with a drink in hand, so just give me a shot if you need me. Man, 
and she's so cool and mature. She and Major Claire show the beauty come in many forms. Better have been someone who has like a beer girl's like an old man. Hey, I can still hear you. And she doesn't even need a hearing aid. You just need to learn to lower your voice. And to have a filter. In any case, we've officially cleared our mission. Excellent work. Thanks. Let's continue with our field exercises. Yeah, that's a fun little fight. We didn't even get to fully exploit the fire nonsense. I mean, you could probably easily hit for like probably close to 25k a, a cannon. Because it was doing like 12k against Bardius when I did the fight again. The problem is just that like we also only got to cast it once because it does have a super long cast time even with Firebell and everything. And it's just uh, getting the Fortunas up. Like, it'd be better if we just had a second caster. Which I guess is supposed to be Altina, but like, come on, look at her. L look at that HP. What, what can I do with 4k base HP? What the hell? What do you want from me? I mean, I guess I could give her, like, Keeper. Kind of like Yuna. I don't know, but it's like I want to use Yuna. Maybe later in the chapter. Maybe for the Star Ritter stuff later on, we'll try and roll Altina and Magic stuff. Because we'll definitely be using Muse there. So we could maybe bench like... Ash or Yuna. Or even Kurt. I mean, I think Kurt is the best party member. Like, straight up. But... If we were going to try and do... Grant, the thing that makes Kurt so good is that he's so, like, buff independent with Blade Dance. I mean, there are some downsides to Blade Dance, which is what makes it kind of interesting. A, the fact that it, he he's very CP hungry in that regard. And it can sometimes mess with your turn orders when you're having to create extra turns. And with your BP and your Brave Orders. So Blade Dance isn't, like, I wouldn't call it overpowered. But it is super nice to have, like, a cheap... Like, self-buff that doesn't actually require you to lose any turns offensively. I forgot what I was going to say. I don't know. We're kind of like an awkward time because we're at 50 minutes and we've talked to everyone. And we're supposed to go do the main story now, but I have no time to record any more videos, really. I've got maybe like 10 to 15 more minutes. I told Toa about the Fromagrass samples. Receptions that the guild knows her plants front to back, so she'll have it analyzed in no time. The Bracer Guild is truly incredible. It's as if they have members for every subject. That's true, they're really helpful. Even I'm not going to disagree with that. It's a nice change of pace, anyway. Thank you. Good thing they're banned in the Empire. No problem. Good luck with your missions. I should be getting a call from the guild here shortly. Got my share of concerns, but eh. I think I'll have to hear back about the samples. Good luck with your missions. Well, make sure we talk to everyone. We can go back. Anything on the West Canyon to check out? Since there was that side quest in the one area. Seems like a big old nope, nope, nopers. Anything on Highway 2? Nope, nope, nopers. Well, I suppose we'll probably just have to call it here. I don't really have time to get, like, wrapped up in any main story stuff with Usus. And there's nothing else really to do. We can... Do some busy work for a second. And we're trying to, like, how do we even make Altina work? It's like, if we were going to roll a magic squad with Muse and without Rain, how would we make this work? I think we probably would straight up ditch Kurt. Well, I don't know. Because it would be Altina and Muse as, like, the core of our damage. Yuna would stay on us as support. And then we would either roll Ash or Kurt. 
Hurt has the benefit of being, like, he can buff himself, which is really strong. Ash has the benefit of, well, not really anything. Because, I mean, the main, like, we're using him kind of as, like, a semi-tank, but that's, you know, not anything due to his own natural abilities. Like, Ash's role can be fulfilled by anyone, basically. Kurt's role can't, because part of what makes Kurt so strong is that he turns CP into damage, basically. Like, much more efficiently than any other character, since he can just kind of stay permanently buffed without any... Like, independently of everyone else. So we would probably roll Yuna, Kurt, Altina, and Muse. And for the most part, everyone would probably say that play the same role. We'd probably give Fortuna to both Yuna and Altina. We'd probably give Altina... The big issue would be that, like... We would probably roll Keeper on both of you, because you're just so fragile. Like, we would probably have Altina and Yuna both as, like, sim like... Yuna full support, Altina semi-support, semi-damage, Muse full damage would be the way we would roll it. Two birds, one stone. Well, alrighty. We'll call it here. Next time we'll go uh, talk to UC, see what he wants, and uh, get some, some main plot stuff going. We, we made our way through the start of day two pretty quickly, actually. When, uh... And all the quests are actually really good. Like I have, I liked all these uh, quests here. The Bardius quest was good. That quest was good. The shop quest was pretty good. The map side quest was, I mean, very simple but cool and a nice little callback. Granted, to a degree, basically every quest in this uh, game at this point is a callback. Like you know, it's like, hey, remember that time you? Did? I mean, then you have like your generic monster quests, which are you know, you fight a monster, and then you have like this is kind of a callback to every other time you train with the army, and uh, same with the the Bardius. Uh, this is kind of a callback quest. Gasping for the. This one was a little bit. I mean, it's just kind of like finding an old object. That one wasn't really. I mean, kind of. It's kind of like the bus quest a little bit, but not really. I don't know. Alrighty. I'm Extra Cheesy 87 Stay tuned for the next part. And bye, guys.